wanted into the warm, warm house, but no one would let the cat in. It was cold outside on Christmas Eve. She meowed and meowed by the door. She was not let into the warm, warm house, and her tiny cries were ignored. Twas a blizzard now, the worst of the year. There was no place for her to hide. Just then, a poor little mouse crept by. He had lost his way in the snow. He was on his last legs and was almost froze. The cat lifted him with her paw. She said, "Poor mouse, do not be afraid, because this is Christmas Eve. On this freezing night, we both need a friend. I won't hurt you." Stay by my side. She dug a small hole in an icy drift. This is where they would spend the night. She curled herself round her helpless friend, protecting him from the cold. Santa came by near the end of the night. The reindeer started to cry. They found the cat lying there in the snow, and they could see that she had died. They lifted her up from the frozen ground and placed her into the sleigh. It was then they saw the little mouse wrapped up. She kept him warm in her fur. Oh, thank you, Santa, for finding us, dear cat. Wake up, we are saved. I'm sorry, mouse, but your friend has died. There's nothing more we can do. On Christmas Eve, she gave you her life, the greatest gift of them all. Santa lifted her up into the night sky and laid her to rest among the stars. Dear mouse, don't cry, you are not alone. You will see your friend every year. Each Christmas, a cat constellation will shine. To remind us that her love's still here. On the twelfth day of Christmas, my true love gave to me twelve drummers drumming, eleven pipers piping, ten lords a leaping, nine ladies dancing, eight maids a milking, seven swans a swimming, six geese a laying. My 